life journey i am vanessa and i live in a van full time how are you guys doing today i am here to cook some liver and some onions and i am here to sew the rest of my mosquito net from my window up front uh i already sewed one the other day but i need to sew this one and also I want to show my subscribers. Some subscribers sent me some cash apps the other day. I needed some black seed oil. So I placed an order the other day for black seed oil and I ordered two bottles. I need two more bottles to take with me on the road. So if anybody want to go to my Amazon wish list, order me two more bottles of black seed oil. Also, I need some more electrolytes. So if you want to order that for me before I leave from out of town, you can and also I bought these underwear I had on my Amazon wish list somebody had ordered them but they never came to me I think and I called Amazon the other night it was a lot of stuff that people ordered off my Amazon wish list that I never received but they sent it to their address so it's like they ordered it for themselves so I went ahead and ordered this with the money that the people sent me I'm gonna try them on. They supposed to be high waisted. And if they fit fine, they're size medium. If they fit fine, I'm gonna put some more pairs of this on my Amazon wish list. Uh, that's all that I ordered from the Amazon wish list. And I should have started the live on the other phone, y'all. Uh, I went to Walmart, I got some onions and I got some liver. So we are about to cook some liver and onion. Hey, Miss Rosalind. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. And you, thumbs up the video, sweetie. Thumbs up the video. So I'm going to show y'all my mosquito net that I made for my front windows. Hey, Miss Angela. How you doing? I'm going to show y'all my mosquito net that I made for my front window. I need to finish sewing the other one. Okay. And I need to sew my magnets on here. So I made that for the window. I just slip it over. And I take my magnets and put it on there. But I'm going to sew my magnets in here. So I don't have to uh, put the magnets on every time I... So I'm going to sew the magnets up in here. Eventually. Uh, so I need to finish sewing the one for the other side. See how it's sewed and it's double-sided so no bugs and nothing could get in there. So whenever I go camping, yeah, I don't have to worry about no uh, flies or I'm having a big, huge problem right now with spiders getting in my van when I be under parked under trees. So... Once I get that, I got to finish making the one on the other side today. And then I got this one right here. And I got some little small magnets on my Amazon wish list, y'all, If and some bigger ones. If anybody want to order those magnets on my Amazon wish list, uh, I could use the magnets for this so I won't have to use the clips. But it's some bigger magnets on there. I think they, I got a couple of packs of them. They like $15 or something. If anybody want to give me those magnets so I won't have to use these clips and that could just magnetize on, then y'all could get that for me. Appreciate it. And in the back, somebody had ordered this mosquito net for me to like put over my hammock or whatever. But when I'm not camping or whatever, I could just use the mosquito net for back here. 
So that's what I'm using today. So I got everything mosquito netted. No flies can come in. And no spiders. Can I get a hand clap and somebody say, yay. Yay. No spiders. And I'm going to go throw since I'm out of the van right now. And I got my fan working today. Miss uh, D had bought me these fans. And as you can see, I got it plugged up to my thing. It's pulling a lot of juice. So I need to get my solar squared away where I could run that fan. And it did, it do have things cooled off a little bit. So, so we got the fan going. I'm gonna go throw this trash away. And so I'm just sitting out at the park, y'all. I'm not, I, I got an apartment somewhere, but <laughs> I got an apartment somewhere, but I come to sit out at the park in the heat Girl, it's a hundred and something degrees in Texas. It was a hundred and four degrees yesterday. But I'm choosing to sit out in all this heat. People don't even think about what they say, y'all. God is really going to judge people for just being so evil. Just what it, what it do for you to say that I'm not living in my van that look like that's a cool area to be parked at. I wonder if they let you park over here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see y'all. Can I park right there? I might try to park right there the next time I come over here. This looks shaded and cool. This look like a good place to park. I don't want to get stuck in no mud, though. Look at all the shade over here. I might try to park here next time. Or maybe not, though. I like being parked on the pavement. So that way, I don't have to worry about no... Nothing crawling on my stuff if I sit my stuff outside. Even though you still kind of have to worry about that. I'll spray the ground. Y'all come on in. Thumbs up the video if you my friend. Come on in. I'm about to cook me something to eat, y'all. I ain't had nothing to eat today. I shouldn't have took my vitamins and stuff that I just took on an empty stomach. But it don't take too long for this liver to cook. I am still on the carnivore diet, you guys, on the 25th. I think it's going to be three months. me doing the carnivore diet. It's going to be three months on the 25th. <laughs> I'm me doing the carnivore diet. So if anybody want to order the big set of magnets on my Amazon wish list, I got another fan. Sometimes I be forgetting who gave me what. But I got another fan. So I'm gonna put these underwear up in my underwear. Hi 
are y'all doing today? Y'all doing all right? Ain't nobody talking to me. Talk to me, talk to me. Talk to me, talk to me. I really wanna know you. Can I talk to you? So the fan adjust. I can turn it. And I got another fan that I'm gonna put in the back. And once I get my solar working, y'all, I had a man was supposed to call me this morning and give me an estimate on what it might cost to fix my solar. So I held off on ordering another part because the lady was telling me that uh, she was gonna let him talk to me and make sure I was ordering the right stuff before I ordered it. And she said he was gonna call me last night or this morning, but he, he did not call me last night. Or this morning so I guess I'm gonna have to call them back I guess I'm gonna have to call them back I'm getting ready to clean off my cabinet so I can Cut my onions up. I'm just gonna cut them up on my cabinet. Hey, Miss Georgette. Hey, Miss Goody. Miss Angela. Miss Georgette. Miss Rosalind. I don't know why y'all ain't talking to me. I be coming on here so y'all can keep me company. I need y'all to talk to me. So what y'all doing today? What is y'all doing? Everybody been doing okay? I know I haven't really been live over here a lot. Y'all been doing okay? Y'all been dealing with this heat? 
dealing with this weather. That fan does make it a little bit better where uh, my phone won't get hot. Somebody playing music, y'all. Hold on. They coming in here backwards. They coming in here the wrong way. I'm cleaning off my cabinet before I start cooking. And I forgot, I cleaned out my purse the other day and I took all this change out of there. So let me put this change up. And then the other day I went washing and I had got change for a 10 and I washed my clothes with that, but then all the quarters that I used, which I think was like $4 worth of quarters, I used to dry my clothes. I got it out my little change thing. I took one of them, uh, them cigarette things from the dollar store that you put your cigarettes in, like an ashtray. And I use it to keep my change in and my cup holder thing. A lot of pennies. That's easy to keep track of my change and to keep the change from getting all trash and stuff on it. The meat diet is supposed to help with any health, health issues. Yes, it's supposed to help with a lot of different health issues. A lot. A lot of health issues, weight loss issues as well. Diabetes as well. A lot of health issues. But I'm not doing it for that reason. I wasn't doing it for that reason. I have lost some weight, and then I think I gained it back. And I might have gained some of it back because I ain't gained it all back. But I might have gained it some of it back because uh, I had been drinking them sparkling water. I bought two onions, y'all. Y'all know I like a lot of onions. And I liver and onions. I actually should have bought more than two onions. The last time I cooked liver and onions at my friend's house, I 
actually had three onions. Actually had three onions. Uh, yes, it's supposed to help with thyroid issues as well. It's supposed to help with all kind of issues. I take my black seed oil and my iodine for my thyroid issues, but yep, it helps with all health issues. Um, let me share the playlist with you that I... Hold on. Hey, Miss Ravishing. Carnivore Diet Playlist. Okay. That's the uh, playlist to the man that I watch to learn the stuff that I know about the carnivore diet. Y'all check out that playlist and when you got time find out the benefits of the carnivore diet i don't like to i like for people to go get the information on their own the people that i watch and learn about the carnivore diet are doctors and they have patients that have been doing a carnivore diet for 10 years um, I am not an extreme, there's, I'm not going to say extreme, strict. There are some carnivores that are strict on the diet. I'm not as strict because some people don't even eat onions and garlic and stuff like that. But I'm going to eat onion and garlic and parsley and cilantro. So, but it's not, it's, if you have willpower, y'all, I got willpower. I can do anything I put my mind to do. I got willpower. So, Vanessa, is the carnivore diet going to be long term? Maybe for me. Maybe, Miss. Uh, 
A lot of people think it's more expensive, but it's actually not because after you, uh, I might do it for a year or two. I might do it for longer than six months. I might, I might go a year. Like I decided to do this to just try it, but it's no reason why I need to stop. It's not. I love the things that I'm eating. I need to go get me some more bacon. I'm feeling a little dizzy right now, y'all, because I'm hungry, and I shouldn't have took that that stuff without uh, on an empty stomach. Hey, Miss D got to have got it having total thyroid surgery and just wanted a second opinion well i wouldn't do the surgery me personally i don't want to do the surgery it and to me okay if you have the surgery you're still gonna have to take medicine for the rest of your life right and that medicine will also give you other side effects. So, to me, if you can try to heal your thyroid naturally with the black seed oil, the iodine, and the carnivore diet, it should work. If you can heal your thyroid naturally and take those things for the rest of your life, black seed oil, iodine, for the rest of your life, What's the difference between black seed oil for the rest of your life and the medicine that's going to cause you side effects? The black seed oil and the iodine are not going to cause you side effects, but they also will help you with other issues that you might have. So it is a more health conscious decision to try to heal your garter, your thyroid issues naturally because even if you have it removed and you get on medication you're still going to have side effects from the other stuff that you're taking and the medicine is not contributing to you being healthy in any other way like the black seed oil and the iodine is so I'm just a, the type of person that did don't really believe in medicine, don't believe in doctors, and I just believe in doing things the natural way. It didn't take, it took years for my garter to get like this. So it may take years for it to completely heal. And it might not ever heal completely, but it's better than it was before. It's my life, so I don't know why people have a problem with what I choose to do medically. I mean, people are so evil, wicked, and negative that they want to tell people whether or not they should have their thyroid removed or not. Or it's just... Uh, I just don't understand it, y'all. I ain't trying to. I'm not worried about what you do with your life. Whether or not you eat yourself to oblivion. Let me. 
handle my health because I am healthier. Just because y'all see a knot in my throat don't mean I'm sick. Like, I ain't taking no medication. I'm not a diabetic. I don't have high blood pressure. Child, some of these people can't talk to me. Don't talk to me about my health. So y'all check out that li that link on the carnivore diet. Even if you're not thinking about doing a carnivore diet, just check it out so you will see what kind of benefits it gives. Miss D, you hit a fan running? You hit a fan running? I got it hooked up to my thing down there. It is draining. It's probably gonna drain that little battery thing. Probably gonna have to charge that soon. But I hope to have my my solar hooked up soon, y'all. Yeah, I just plugged it into my little thing. I think it's gonna drain my battery down real quick. But I wanted to do my live, so. And I still need to figure out where I'm gonna put the other one at, in the back somewhere. I don't know where I'm gonna put it at. I got it and I need to put it up. I got it. And I need to put it up. Okay, I got my onions all cut up. I'm going to put me some ghee up in here. Uh-huh, it feels good. I don't even know what speed it up it's on. It's a... Uh, I shouldn't have turned it off. It won't come back on now. Oh, there you go. Okay, I think that's high. I feel it blowing. It's like keeping me from sweating and it's keeping it circulated, keeping my phone from dying and overheating. So it's doing something, girl. Yes, Vanessa, your gorder is almost gone. And when you hold your head a certain way, it looks like it is not even there. I know my friend, they've been knowing me for years. Like when I hold it this way, I think it look gone on this side. My friend had been knowing me for years. I don't know if y'all heard her say this the other day. I think I was live. She said to her, my daughter is completely gone. She said, because she remember how big it was, she say to her, this is nothing. She say she need, she see normal people with fat on their necks bigger than this. And I don't know why people so worried about my daughter, because some people have necks bigger than mine because they're overweight. I'm not understanding why. You so bothered. Y'all, I went in my closet the other day and I pulled these clothes out. I was gonna throw them away, but then I put them in this bag. These are dresses and stuff that I'm just gonna get rid of. And I've been waiting to see a homeless woman or somebody pass by so I could just give her the whole little thing. I don't see nobody soon, child. I'm trying not to throw it away, but I'll just probably take it by goodwill. But I'm trying to find somebody that need it. 
trying to see if I can find a homeless person or somebody to pass it by. These are just my pillows. Once I get through cooking, I can put them back. Propane must be almost out. It's kind of low. So I got my ghee. Most of the carnivores either eat ghee or butter. I'm going to take two of these. Stir it up in there. Because we don't use cooking oil, y'all. On the carnivore diet, they want you to eat as much fat, good fat, that you can. And so butter, even though it's a lot of fat, it's actually good for you on this diet. So you can either eat butter or ghee. So y'all see me cooking with a lot of butter. Y'all probably don't think that cloths are your artery. Arteries, but there is research that's been done that Real butter is good for you, opposed to that saturated fat and the canola oil and the, all of that. So I'm going to put this on the stove, saute this, and then I'm going to put my liver in the pan. And I'm going to just season my liver while it's in the pan. I'm not going to do it separately. I'm making liver and onions. Uh, Miss Goody say, oh, she already has said that about my daughter. So y'all, why them onions is sauteing? I wanna sew my, my other mosquito net. Did y'all see my mosquito net thing? Or the child coming here late. I'm making a mosquito net thing for my window. I already got one completed. Did y'all see it already? Or do I need to show it to y'all again? So when I go camping, y'all. I could sit in the van and don't have to worry about the flies or at night I could leave this open longer or if I want to sleep with my window open at night when I'm at a campground only
What's good, Miss uh, D? Okay. This is the other one that I made already and I completed. It's all sewn up, but I need to take my magnets and I need to sew my magnets in there. So that's the next thing I'm gonna do. But this one right here, I just took some extra cloth and threw it on there. But this other one is the one I need to finish sewing so it can be permanent. I knew I had did this the wrong way. I just want to double check before I sew this. I turned it inside out and I had cut it and I cut it wrong, but it's still gonna work. It's gonna be a snug fit, which is good. It's gonna be a snug fit. Which is good. Y'all hear them flies trying to get up in here. on my Amazon wish list, I mean some magnets that I need so I won't have to use the clamps because the clamps can put a hole in that thing. The clamps can put a hole in that thing. Did y'all see my mosquito net?
like a Tuesday to you. I start taking my black seed oil again because I haven't been taking my black seed oil last. I mean, my uh, iodine the last two months. So I'm gonna start back taking it again. So next time is goody. I go camping.
got my red mint salt. We're supposed to use a lot of salt, y'all. Parsley. Parsley, it had a little, little left up in there, so I went ahead and used the rest of that black pepper. Hey, uh, simply me. I am listening to hubby cooking dinner, so I am washing the dishes. What you, uh, what he cooking? How you been doing, Miss Simply Me?
I didn't season it like I normally do on both sides in a plate. So I hope it has enough, enough seasoning on it. I don't like to add seasoning to my food after it's cooked. Let me stir my liver. So what's the progress on your, on what's been going on with you? <laughs> Simply me, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, I am good, just busy working. I've been watching your trips to parks and making me jealous. I just received my retirement package to start the process that's good been traveling to Louisiana a lot and how are you doing I'm doing fine child trying to survive came back to Houston to take care of some business I'm ready to get back on the road I'm trying to get my solar taken care of before I 
get back on the road. So. This man was supposed to call me this morning. But I need to put his number in my other phone because... I'm live right now on the other phone and I can't call them. So, I'm just still working on little projects so that way when I go out of town, I'll be comfortable and be able to just sit and chill. So I'm making a mosquito net from my windows right now. So that way when I'm out at a campground, cause girl, them spiders, ooh wee child. I done got bit, I got bit on my arm the other day, right here. And I've been, Working it around and squeezing it. I put some of that poison ivory stuff on there. But I done got bit a couple of times. I done exterminated the van. But once I get these nets fixed up and I set them up every time I go set out. I could exterminate the van again. I could exterminate the van again. These spiders, they better not let me see them. That's all I know. It's looking a little cloudy outside. I have forgot to put my top I think I might have to, because I messed this thing up. I think I might have to, I'm, I think I'm going to have to make this over again. Because I think it's messed up.
I messed this up and I don't think it's on work. I cut it on the wrong side. I cut a hole in it. Did y'all hear about R. Kelly getting married, y'all? The child here by R. Kelly getting married, who would want to marry a man that done just got 30 years? I'm not about to be married. That man got some power over people. That is totally brainwashed. Totally, totally brainwashed. Would y'all marry somebody that, that is going to be in prison for 30 years? Mm -mm. He trying to get him some conjugal visits. I wouldn't touch R. Kelly with a 10 foot pole. All them demonic spirits. Hey, God's child, how you doing? The child here about R. Kelly supposed to be getting married, y'all. When a fan is working to keep the to keep the uh, phone from dying. Uh oh, it's using a lot of my battery. Now.
I couldn't keep that plugged up there today all day. But I could if I had solar. Okay, y'all, that's the liver and the onions. Child, what park you going to? That would be nice. Father God, thank you for this food we're about to receive. Your blessings, your kindness, your mercy, your grace, all the provisions you made up in my life. In Jesus' name, amen. What park are you talking about? You want to go to the Blue Lagoon with me? Put it in the three windows. I've been good, God's child. Mm. I've been good. Someone wanted what that bag? Someone wanted what but that bag? Yeah. I love me some in liver onions. They say you can actually eat liver and onions every day. I need some bacon. That liver and onions and bacon. What's so good? I'm surviving. I don't know what simply me talking about. Simply me, I don't understand your last comment. Y'all, thumbs up the video. y'all been eating more meat in y'all diet even if you can't do the carnivore diet you could do a couple of meals a week
that you just meat. Cut out all the carbs, cut out all the bread, cut out all the starch. Try to start eating these in the middle of the It's good for you. I don't know what happened to Simply Me. I could probably eat all this living onion at one time. Hispanic people using the N word with each other. Yesterday it was 102. Hey Siri. What's the temperature? It's about 97 degrees outside. It's 97 degrees, but the only reason why it's 97 degrees is because it's cloudy. my mosquito net up. It kind of serves as a privacy curtain. Girl, yesterday, no, I think yesterday it was 102 degrees. The day before that, it was 104. That's too hot.
Oh. Someone wanted him that bad. Girl, one of them babies. That was his victim. I said, which, where, we, where are you trying to go, Miss uh, Simply Me? What park are you trying to go to? You trying to stay in Houston or go to a surrounding city? You got some days off? got some days off DM me on Instagram that was good y'all I could eat all that liver like I ate all that chicken yesterday I haven't been eating regular like I should. I'm gonna eat the rest of that liver in a little bit. I'm gonna wait. It's about eight or nine. I'm not full. Yes, simply me. See, when you go to prison, you can't get conjugal visits unless you marry. So, they be getting them women to get married them. So they can get them conjugal visits. I ain't marrying nobody that's going to be in prison for 30 years. This heat been on overdrive non-stop. Girl, I know in Houston... Well, in Texas, girl, we ain't been getting no rain. Y'all, I'm going to need some more liver. I was going to wait till later. But later is right now. on my plate them packages be coming with four pieces in it so i got one more Ooh, that's two pieces i wonder i'm still hungry i think one of my pieces had broke up so i might eat this and still have another piece on my plate i'm gonna put my pop mm. No, oh, that's so hot and good. Mm. I love me some living onion, y'all. It tastes 
so good. They can't really look in and be nosy. Simply me, do you know how to swim? how to swim We need some rain. That fan feel good. Yeah, Walmart have a little air condition. little small air condition it's like a hundred I think it was 168 and then when I went back I seen it on sale for 156 I think It was so small and cute. I think it could fit in my window, my front window. When I'm sitting out at a campsite, I was considering getting one in a, in a, eventually.
y'all taking a nap or something? Are y'all taking a nap or something? Hey there, queen. I got one more piece of meat in the skillet. Surrounding city weekend. I'm going to DM you. My fishing pole is broke. I need another fishing pole. Excuse me, y'all.
sliver to give you the vitamins and the minerals that you need. I ate three pieces of liver. I'm gonna need some more of this soon. Oh, real soon. It's on the Amazon wish list. Even though it say I got some, that mean I need more. That just mean I I used what I have already. Mm. I was drinking them sparkling waters for a little minute. I'm getting ready to cut them out. And just drink them out with no water. Yep, what? <sighs> mm. I could just lay out. You have a hammock. One of my favorite pastimes is laying in a hammock and falling asleep. Oh, that feels so good. <sighs> Lay in the hammock. I never seen if it was somewhere I could put my hammock over here. I be coming over here to be working on my van, y'all. So I've never really walked the trails out here and chilled. Okay, y'all, let me see. I was sewing this thing, but then I got to this other part. I 
be right back. Okay, I need to thread my needle. Hello, everybody. Are y'all sleepy? Did y'all go take a nap? What's going on? play mind games with the trolls. The trolls want to know, do 
I get food stamps and do I get uh, disability check? No. <laughs> you supposed to have all the answers to the question. <laughs> I'm going to tell you anything you want. I'm going to tell you whatever. That's so funny. Y'all supposed to know everything. You know all my business. You tell me. Whatever you say is true. Because you don't lie. Yep, I get food stamps. Nope, I don't get food stamps. <laughs> yep, I get a check. Nope, I don't get a check. your story. It's your story. It's your story. And I'm going to tell y'all people, y'all better stop saying things like she don't live in her van full time. She has an apartment. Y'all better stop saying that. Because that's deformation of character. That's trying to make my subscribers believe something that's not true. And that's actually deformation of character. Because everything you say, you need to have proof of it. Mm -hmm. You say she don't live in her van. That's a lie. You have to have proof of that. I say I do. You say I don't. But I'm gonna let all of y'all keep talking. Every last one of y'all, even y'all broke bitches, that's just as broke as me, I'm going to let y'all keep talking. Hey Marion, how you doing? Come on in and talk to me, Marion. 
Nobody else is talking to me. I don't know what happened to them. They went to sleep or something. But come on and talk to me. How was your day today? Making my mosquito net from my window. I done actually messed it up, but I'm trying to make it work. I got an extra piece, so I might do it over. trying to make it work. Uh, what are you doing today? I just got through cooking some liver and onions. And I'm making a mosquito net from my window. I already made one for the front. No hammock. That is the best, that's the number one thing you need to get is a hammock, girl. I don't know what I would do without a hammock. I want to lay in a hammock right now. So what you did today, Miss Mariam? First back at back into the office since the virus. Mm -hmm. You feeling all right? feeling I'm gonna have to make another one of these but I'm trying to salvage this thing cuz I messed it up
people think you get a check, well, they want to know too much. <laughs> My good friend lost one of her eyes as a child, and she has no disability check. She works. Yep, they want to know a lot. They want to know if I get a check. They want to know if I get food stamps. But they around here saying I do get them. So, yep, I get a check. I get food stamps. Nope. I don't get a check. Nope. I don't get food stamps. It's your story. You tell it. It's your story. You tell it. I don't owe nobody no explanation for what I get and what I don't get. And you shouldn't be worried about what I get and what I don't get. And you shouldn't be worried about what my subscribers give me either. Why are you mad? Why are you mad? What you get? What your subscribers give you? Worry about that. I tell you. This black people for you. This black people. That's why God always use in my real life. It don't be black people that walk up to me on the street and bless me. It's always been the Caucasians that God used bless me just complete strangers walk up to me and say God told me to give you this it's sad that and now you know Mary and now they saying I don't live in my van I'm lying about that they better be careful of the stuff they saying I'm lying about because that's defamation of character I'm, I'm not correcting no more. I'm not correcting. And even when I correct them, you don't know if I'm telling the truth or not. Because you're going to say I'm lying anyway, so what's the point in telling the truth? You're going to say I'm lying anyway, so I ain't telling the truth. I'm lying. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The devil gonna only play the part he wanna play anyway. Yep, Marion, I don't live in my van. I'm lying about living in my van full time, child. I don't never take y'all nowhere that I go. Y'all don't never see me traveling. How y'all really know I'm traveling? I'm lying about that too. I just, I'm a, just a compulsive liar like Cindy. Lie for no reason. How did you learn how to sew? I don't know how to sew, but I took home it when I was in school. A couple of years. But, I told y'all before, we never had new clothes. And one time I took a pair of my mama pants and cut them up and sewed them back together <laughs> to make me a pair of pants. Because we never got new clothes. to learn how to be get creative when you po and y'all know I'm po I got to make everything thank God for my subscribers which that's who they're trying to attack they're trying to attack my subscribers to keep you guys from giving me stuff and helping me because they don't want to they know that y'all the only 
you know, that y'all the reason why I have everything I have and while I'm while I'm why why I'm able to put gas in my car. So they wanna spread all these lies and say all this stuff to try to put doubt in y'all head and make y'all stop donating to me. That's not gonna stop me, baby. If I got to walk to where I'm going, if I got to become a backpacker. See, you can't stop somebody that intends to to uh, succeed. You can't stop somebody like me. I'm gonna succeed no matter what, and I ain't got to lie, steal, and kill to do it. I ain't got to try to make y'all look bad to get what I need. God not gonna bless nothing not a dime that y'all make. He ain't gonna bless it. Cause you're doing it off of lies. At least I can hold my head up straight and know I ain't lying on nobody. But whatever I have, I have. Whatever I don't, I don't. And I ain't got the lie to get more. sleep at night. Some of y'all can't even sleep. I sleep good at night in my hot band. Uh, you know, our own people can be the worst ones. We are the worst ones. Why are they worried? Are they giving you anything? And thank you. Did you, you heard me say thank you for what you gave me the other day, right? I appreciate it. I'm waiting on that man to call me for the solar so I know how much I need to get my solar fixed, but he ain't called me back. And his number on the phone that I'm live on, uh, I can relate. I had five sisters ahead of me. Nothing ever lasted long enough for me to get hand me down child I was the oldest we just never got anything new I wish they would have had the 25 cents thrift store oh what you gave was a blessing Everything that everybody give me is a blessing. It all adds up for my needs to be met. And I thank God for that. God is good all the time. And they so mad. Because God is good. I ain't never seen nobody mad. Because God bless somebody. They want you not to be blessed. Some of them people going to be balled up in a knot somewhere in a corner. Paying for their sins. just sitting out working just working being at peace while I'm accomplishing something 
it's this little stuff, but this little stuff take a lot of time. This little stuff is time consuming. So this is the one I messed up, y'all. So I don't think this one gonna be perfect. Let me see. How this Honestly, should I bring this phone charger with me? And yes, I should. See, this one not gonna be perfect because I messed it up. <laughs> See, this one is better, but I need to sew the bottom and put the magnets on it. So I won't have to keep putting them on there every time. So let me try this on here and take this off. See, I had messed this up, so it is it's tight. I'm probably going to have to make another one. Because this is a tight fit. It don't have no sweat, which could be a good thing. I think I'm gonna make another one because I need to make one to show y'all how to make it. Y'all see that? 
And that way, the only magnets I need is at the bottom. And if it's secure, I could fix that. But I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna make me another one. I got some more material. So that's my mosquito net on my window. And so now I need to put a hem here and put my magnets in there. So I won't have to keep taking my magnets on and off. And I might end up making me another one because I got enough material. This was a trial run. I might make me another one, a better one. So I might do this over and just leave the magnets like this for now. And when I do my other one, uh, I'll make it better. So, I think that's all I have to do with that. I'm gonna put these. I don't know what I did with the mother magnets. I think I'm going to make another one eventually. I probably don't worry about it right now, but I might make another one next week because I forgot what I did with the mother magnets. Y'all here? Y'all here, y'all here, y'all here. <sighs> what time is it? Oh, it's seven o'clock. Okay, y'all, I'm going to let y'all go. Y'all ain't talking to me anyway. Thank y'all for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell. Hit always. And be sure to watch some more videos if you want to support the channel. All my information is in the description box below. My cash app, my PayPal, my Amazon wish list. 
and my mailing address. And I'm about to turn my fan off because oh, my battery now is almost drained all the way down. It was, it was full. Now it's on two. So I'm gonna turn it off. I just had that on so that fan wouldn't, uh, so the uh, phone wouldn't get hot. But I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. And I'm going to talk to y'all later. Y'all have a good evening. I'm sure I'll be live somewhere tonight. So I'll talk to y'all later. Bye now. Thanks for watching. Vanessa's Van Life Journey. My one-year anniversary. I've been living in the van for one year, y'all.